Yes, sir. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ, coming to you live with another video, man. Check it out, man. I got more videos coming up about the free agency, but look, we just gonna get straight to it. Money on the flow. Let's get straight to it. Gordon Hayward's going to Boston. What do you think it means? We don't have anything on the contract or any of the particulars or anything. How many years or all of that good stuff? If I had to guess, I'd probably say. Um, Maybe one of those three-year contracts or whatever. I, I got no clue. We don't know that right now. Uh, the article is just it's, it's like a couple minutes old. But check it out, man. What does this do for the um, for these guys, man, for the Celtics, man? So what you're going to have? You're going to have probably Isaiah Thomas, Avery Bradley, or Smart is going to be playing the two. You'll have um, Gordon Hayward at three. You're going to have Al Horford at the four. Kelly Olenek at the five. You know you're going to have Zeller in there playing. You're going to have Amir Johnson playing some of the both of the, both of the four positions, I, I, would, I would think. But uh, it's a hell of an upgrade, man. That's all I can tell you. Um, does this give them enough? I mean, then you got Tatum Finn in there somewhere, too. Is this enough to beat the Cavs? That's all we really want to know. I think that they can actually go toe-to-toe -to -toe a little bit better this year. You know, with this team, depending on how Gordon plays defense and all that, uh, then the Cavs, then, then they did last year. Obviously, they're going to be better, but I, I just don't know if um, if this gets them by the Cavs. Obviously, I feel like they will make it to the Eastern Conference Finals this year. They're probably going to be number two in the uh, East. And, uh, you know, the Cavs probably going to be number one. They'll be number two. I think they'll probably win about 60 games or something like that. You know, uh, 55, 60 games, something like that. I, don't, I, don't, I think that this puts them clearly, clearly – number two in the east but um i don't know if this gets you by the Cavs. I, I just don't know i mean like i said i mean it, it's gonna be tough but i just don't know but i tell you what i definitely don't think it gets you by golden state i feel like paul george pr could probably get you by golden state but can gordon hayward get you by golden state the reason i say that because for paul george's defense is a lot better than golden state right so i mean it's a lot better than um Gordon Hayward. Not that Gordon Hayward doesn't play defense, but I just feel like Paul George is like top is like a top tier defender. You know, he's like he's in the he's not up there with Kawhi, but he's right behind Kawhi, if you if you understand what I'm saying. So he's like, he's an elite defender. I, I think Gordon Hayward is, is probably a, is is a, is a decent to good defender. So you know you got guys like Clay and 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 Paul George and 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 Kawhi. Those are the elite defenders and then you, you then you got the next tier or whatever. So you know everybody and nobody can really stop anybody in the NBA. So you know it's kind of like that. That's how I feel about it. But um as far as defense goes, I mean he's pretty good defender. I'm not I'm I, I can't hate on that. But I just don't know if this gets you by the Cavs. It can get you by the Cavs if they play properly, they play right. The Cavs have a bad game here or there, something like that. I think it can get you by the Cavs, but I just don't think it gets you by Golden State unless they're clicking on all cylinders. And like I said, I, I do feel like Paul George could probably get you by them. But um, it, it really is just going to come down to your center and, smart and, and, and power forward play. Um, your boy going to have to rebound. Uh, 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 who do we have uh, that came from the Hawks? Al Horford is going to have to rebound, and the Bees is going to have to play play well. And Kelly Olynyk going to have to stay in games and not snatch people's shoulders out of the socket. Uh, you know, like that. They just they just will have to be. It's going to come down to the down low play. Is is what I really feel like. But uh, they definitely have the firepower. They can definitely get by the Cavs if they play properly and and defend well. But uh, I just don't know if this actually really 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 gets you by the Cavs. I definitely don't think it gets you by Golden State. But um, you know, it is what it is, man. It's a good, it's a good pickup for them. And um definitely makes you number two in the East. But anyway, that's enough of what I think, man. You guys signed off in the comments, tell me what you think. Um, does this does this get them by the Cavs? Or is is King James just not gonna it doesn't matter. Nobody can can make it out of the East because LeBron's will is just too strong. I don't know, man. You let me know. I'm out of here. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Holla! They sixed out this mug.